Today, the second test with air fryer liners. Hey, and welcome. Today is the second test with the air fryer liners. Today I'm going to be doing fluidy type thing, bolognese type thing. Now I put fluids to the test and it didn't come out very well. Now this time, with any luck, I can do something along the lines of spaghetti bolognese. But I don't like bolognese sauce, so it'll be along the lines. Let's give it a go. To start with, a bit of mint in. That goes in there. I'm going to start that cooking, try and get out some of the fat. It's only 5% fat, this mint, but I want to get a bit more out. Bonk it in. Just hit go on it. And then I'll come and check it shortly, give it a mix around just to try and get it cooking evenly, but we're mainly getting the fat out. That should do. has got most of the, uh, or some of the fat out, so we've got a bit less in there. Pop that into a nice clean one. Add some peas. Couple of mushrooms, like that. A spring onion, like that. Give it a quick mix around. Sachet of a chasseur sauce. And 400 25 ml of water. Give that a quick mix. In goes the mix. Pour in the sauce. Hold on. Give it a swish around again. Now this can go into an air fryer and I've got to work out what the lowest temperature is it goes to. It goes down to 80. Cool. So we'll put it on 80 for 15 minutes for the minute. Now for the spaghetti. Now I'm fairly sure that these holes are supposed to be a measure, so if I go through the smallest hole there, it's meant to be enough for one person. And 
there has always a silly idea because one person would eat three times what they always tell us to eat. So. Spaghetti in there on heat. Now I've got to be honest, I've never ever cooked spaghetti in my life. So I was very tempted to get that tin spaghetti with the tomato ketchup, but I thought that was a bit, bit silly, even for me. So I'll put that on, let that come to the, uh, the boil, I guess. I've just had a great idea. If I chuck this garlic in with the spaghetti, it might give it a good flavour. It might not, but who knows? It's been in there now for 10 minutes at 80. Now it's time to cr now it's time to crank it up a bit <laughs> to 180. At the moment, the sauce isn't thickening. So I'm gonna have to add some corn flour in a bit of cold water and give that a mix, lob it in, and hopefully that'll help thicken it. One of them. Give that a bit longer. To test spaghetti, I do believe you've got to throw it at the wall. I have no idea why, but it sort of sticks. Now, whether that's done or whether that's not done, I don't know, but it sticks. The air fryer is now finished. That's been on for half an hour, 15 minutes, no, 30 minutes at 180. The original 10 minutes at 80 was complete and utter waste of time. So let's get and dish this baby up. Taking it out with a spoon is probably the best idea. So that's what we're doing. Now. plan for the sauce was to make a roux, add the chasseur sauce to that and that'd be nice thick but for some silly reason I didn't bother going ahead with that. Anyhow, now it is time for that all-important taste test. First of all, did the spaghetti get the flavour of the garlic in it? Yes, it did. Ooh. And the chicken chasseur spaghetti bolognese mix tastes fantastic.
My air fryer pan is a bit of a mess. Well, the liner anyway. But that doesn't matter, straighten the dishwasher. Can you do spaghetti chasseur um, thing? Whatever you want to call this, in an air fryer. Yes, you can. Would I recommend it? Not in one of them. If you've got one where it's got the bigger bowl, then you can get more in there, because I could hardly get anything in there. It's only one meal's worth. So if you're cooking for more than one, then... But if it's just one of you, then yes, you can. Does chasseur sauce work like this? Chasseur sauce works with anything. I mean, come on, let's be honest, it's amazing. This, I give it a thumbs up. It tastes great. I'm annoyed about the sauce. That was meant to be nice and thick, but it didn't work. And I know why, so that's my own fault. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. And I shall see you again next time. Sala. So, so much fun, some of them as well. <laughs>